everyone, what is up? Hopefully you guys are having an amazing day. Today we're going to be talking about what is happening with XRP in the XRP community. Now on CoinMarketCap, XRP is at $0.24. Cents. It is being stable right now, but we can see Bitcoin is going slowly up, up, and up. But now guys, before we jump into news, I'd like to say I'm not a financial advisor, nor is financial advice, just just intimate value only. JPS, we know, XRP just started going crazy on Fiat League. That was fast. Leia Suido, what's the issue with XRP? Hey guys, so I just logged onto Twitter on this fine, fine morning and I see a lot of talk about XRP being a scam. So this is really interesting because I think you guys know that I've been quite honest about the fact that I don't own any XRP. I'm not a huge fan of it. Um, but in terms of it being a scam, I've never sort of been on that wavelength. So I really want to just sort of like settle this once and for all because I often find any time that I talk about XRP, things blow up. Um, so I kind of want to get to the bottom of this. I want to settle this once and for all. What is the problem with XRP? Um, or what isn't the problem with XRP? What's great about it? Let me know, tell me. We need to settle this. What is going on with XRP? So guys, leave it down below in the comments. What's so great about XRP? If you look at the people that left their jobs to go work at Ripple, that should tell you all you need to know. But XRP has sweet out. There are tokens being used in regulated sections. I mean, I'm thinking of XRP in this case, but uh, you know where I think, I'm gonna take the long view. I think there's gonna be a lot of volatility. Uh, I think what we're building has, you know, it's solving a real problem. And I think all of the tokens, my advice to anybody would be understand the utility. If there's real utility and there's real value being delivered to a real customer, there will be value in the token. Otherwise, I think, you know, be careful. When we talk about the market. We are essentially placing our bets beyond hypothetical scenarios. Almost everything looks good on paper. Onward. Peter Pumpkin is sweet out. Look, my, my view on this is pretty outrageous. Here's somebody who held XRP for, I think, two weeks' time and is making some claims. Uh, you know, whether or not XRP is a security is not going to be dictated by, you know, one lawsuit. The SEC, obviously, is, uh, the, the SEC in the United States is the, the governor of that. And I think it's very clear that XRP is not a security. You know, it, it does, it's an, it exists independently of Ripple, the company. If Ripple, the company, shut down tomorrow, the XRP ecosystem would continue to exist. It's an independent open source technology. From an ownership point of view, owning XRP doesn't give you any ownership of Ripple equity. And ultimately, as we just talked about, XRP has a lot of utility. And so it's, it, to me, it's quite different than what a security you know, looks like. And I think ultimately we'll, we'll find that conclusion. Is regulation at all a risk to your business? I actually think regulation is a benefit to our business. I think those that think the blockchain revolution is to attack the government or attack regulation, I think they're just wrong. You know, the, the blockchain revolution is happening from within the system, not from outside the system. I think one of the reasons why Ripple has enjoyed so much momentum is because we've been working with regulators. We count the, the Bank of England as a customer of ours. The Saudi Arabian Monetary Authority is a customer of ours. We're working with other central banks around the world. And I think it's because of that engagement, we're continuing to see them embrace and see the benefits of using these technologies. But what happens if XRP is classed as a security? What does that mean for your X rapid product, for example? I, 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 I can't think of many arguments why XRP would be deemed a security, and so I, I'm not too worried about it. He isn't too worried about it, guys. Neither should we be, but 
regulations are a benefit for us. Now guys, we're still a fun part of XRP in the XRP community. Now this is quite interesting. The third eye is sweet out. Emergency. As you can see right here, emergency broadcast system. So what do you guys think this means? This it comes from New Cox. Remember this? I'm expecting a modest $5. Two digits will occur rapidly as banks quickly go live. Three digits when XRP is announced as a standard. As you can see guys, XRP will be the biggest wealth opportunity in our lifetimes. I'll just our suit out, XRP is reaching critical mass, silent avalanche as we have seen on Fiat leak as well. Once again from Valjester, lights out. Do you see the price before or after blackout? When is regulations after blackout, during and after, during for the first takeoff and after for the results? Credible crypto suite out in the midst of the start of a new bull run, this statement should make you salivate. If you see this and think time to sell XRP, you are doing it wrong. See this for the opportunity that it is. XRP. XRP is the only large cap that hasn't pumped yet. Next it comes from Luminous Design, Coinbase new update for 15th November about using e-money and e-wallets that is your CBDCs. A hosted digital wallet e-money wallet enabling you to store electronic money issued by CB payments which is denominated in fiat currency e-money and certain payment services enabling you to send and receive e-money. Again a lot of stuff seems to be happening when? In November. Interesting. Distributed minus sweet out real time XRP markets with gold, silver, and crude and crude oil. Happy to see tickers and trading. Pretty cool. Oh yeah. And for your information, nothing for Bitcoin. What do we see here, guys? Look at all these pairs. XRP gold, XRP silver, and all of this as well. But nothing with Bitcoin. Reborn a sweet out, everything that we have seen so far this year was foretold. Geographical disasters, as we can see that, riot, stock market plummet, oil crash, push for digital, regulations, peace in the Middle East. There is one thing left on the horizon, GCR, RV, XRP is the final piece. NCG Rothschild's a sweet out, get out of the stock market now, don't even try to short it. Maybe the market get frozen and you can't move your trades when you have to. Today after work, go to your bank or precious metals dealer and buy enough physical silver or gold coins. Don't hoarder cash US dollar. Something is brewing up with the stock market guys by the looks of it. The Burble Bowl is sweet out this from a couple months ago, but we can see here the takeaway. Global digital currencies are already here, developed by the private sectors. Central banks are responding to the challenge of private sector digital currencies by accelerating the pace at which international payments go real time and by looking into creating their own digital currencies. What do we think here, CBDCs? Once again from Valjester, see all the confusion, strife, and FUD surrounding XRP, the chosen one, ma making even the most renowned to shake in their boots, even with the best news in our faces. Isn't it quite interesting that XRP is the only coin which people either love or either hate it? The final tip for today's video comes from Baba Cugs. Here are things you would have never noticed. Kichiro, we can see right here, those numbers. Yang Yang, as above, so below. Just to validate, nothing was ever by coincidence. As we've seen, in a period of 24 hours, watch and learn. Not 24 hours from now, HODL. This was from a while back ago, but again guys, as you can see, the 24 hour period. But who really knows what will happen at the end of the day. But anyways guys, hopefully you guys did enjoy today's video. If you guys did, please leave a like. Subscribe if you guys haven't already. Feel free to be a member of the channel. I'll see you guys in the next video. Hopefully you guys are having an amazing day. And hey guys, see ya. This is the beginning of the greatest economic cycle this country has had since World War II. And I knew the things that Donald would do. And he hasn't even got started. But this is the eye of the mother from storm. The perfect storm. It ain't never going to get any better. Never. This is perfect for the QLA model. If I could have written the mother a prescription or a formula, I couldn't have written it any better. 
Low interest rates, money's free. You stupid f Massive chaos. And Donald's gonna rip the mother economy apart. And he's gonna f for practice in a good way. This is it. It ain't never gonna get any better. This is like a multiple orgasm in the rest of your life, you fucking slags that are in the audience. This is it. Sometimes I don't wanna hear what Dan has to tell me. But as I wrote in one of my blogs, the old man, he's always right. Because he's telling you what you don't want to hear about yourself, but what you know is true. And that is, you're not stepping yourself up. You're not stepping your game up. And you get caught up in fear. As Dan says, false expectations appear in you.